welcome to Planet Mental Mambo. So during my Fight Club webinar, aka Manage Workplace Conflict Like a Boss, a scenario which popped up was where one of the participants was the leader of a team and we spoke about boundaries between leaders and then um, managers and team members who report into the leader. So every one of us is uh, a leader, a manager, an operator at um, various times in our lives and careers. However, when it comes to workplace role design, oftentimes the leader is more tasked with the strategic, the why we do what we do, the what needs to be done at strategic level, the most important priorities. And then, you know, there needs to be a communication progress in terms of these priorities to the managerial team and the people reporting into the managers, reporting to the leader. So that the beautiful boundaries and, and the, the lines in the sand between the why, the what should be done, the how should it be done, the who should do it, the when should it be done, the when should it be completed and the quality level at which it should be completed, which then ties all the way back to that headline or the, the, the top line strategic imperatives. The results, the events and the numerically based verifiable measurable results of the organization. So last night's participant said his most conflict arose in terms of the how things should be done with his team members. And that was a bit of a tripwire question from me because um, gently yet also brutally I put a mirror in front of him and said sir if you look carefully at your role design, which I haven't seen, so it's for you to look at it and you know have get some support in terms of really analyzing what your role is supposed to be about. If you are too involved with people reporting into you in terms of the how things should be done, you know, you are more the why and the what candidate as the leader. If you meddle too much in the how, you're going to pacify your employees reporting into you managers and staff you are going to cause them to wait for you because you know every time they start doing something um, you're there over their shoulder helicopter parenting so that was straight talk moment so in terms of hi there in terms of your own workplace scenario if you find yourself regularly experiencing these conflicts these tensions with people reporting to you and it's about the how it should be done consider asking people reporting to you how do you think it should be done and if they come come with a, a suggestion which is good enough to achieve the outcome which you see as the visionary as the leader let them do it let them build trust in their own abilities it's going to free you up to do the outward facing leadership activities which is so part and parcel of most leadership roles hashtag may you be the empowering trust inspiring leader you wish to see in the world today